All right, rapid fire run through of all the Easter eggs and references I noticed on the cover of Exquisite Exandria, Critical Role's new cookbook. We've got Matt's arm complete with his iconic bracelets reading what could be a Dungeon Master's Guide or source book. A bowl of almonds, a reference to Brennan Lee Mulligan and his rant during the GM roundtable. Dried and pressed flowers, a reference to Yasha, which are right next to Bo's arm, who is eating what I think could be insects, which would be another Yasha reference. Bo is also drinking what appears to be a ruby of the sea, perhaps from the Bow Rabar itself. An assortment of baked goods and sweets, including several loaves of bread, hopefully none of which Caleb has stuck his hands in to keep warm. And of course, around these sweets, we have none other but Jester's arm reaching out for some iconic Black Moss cupcakes, complete with the dust of deliciousness on top, a reference to one of the most iconic D&D moments of all time. Below that, we have Scanlan's hand pies, a reference to his purple poop from campaign one. Here we have an eye of Ukatoa, Ukatoa, in this glass of water. Next, we've got Estorosh's maple ginger cookies, the bestest boy Frumpkin himself, FCG's arm and a bowl of coins for them to eat, and one singular button amidst the coins as a reference to Veth, Chetney's chisel complete with an RTA engraving, Tarion Darrington's book, and Dodie's quill, which seems to be one of Vex's blue feathers. We have Sean Gilmore's hand reaching for the classiest item on the table, the charcuterie board. Vax's Daga 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 and an empanada, of which there are none in Diastock. And here we have Grog and Pike's arms, with Grog wearing the Titan Stone knuckles and reaching for an entire chicken, which has two of Vex's arrows protruding from it, a reference to her target practice in the mansion. And of course, we have a side of mayonnaise, Grog's favorite for all of his dipping or drinking needs. And speaking of drinking, we have this tankard here, which looks a lot like one the cast has used over the years. Here we have Orem's arms right in front of his favorite, a pie, a reference to his wild times in Byroden during EXU. And he is also drinking tea, presumably dead people tea, as it is being poured by Caduceus. And in front of Caduceus, we have what appears to be some simple vegetable toast, as he is a vegetarian. And here we have an assortment of autumn leaves, which could be a reference to Keyleth. And finally, smack dab in the center of the table, we have one of Grog's axes. Alrighty, y'all. I don't actually own this cookbook yet, so I can't double check any of these, but please let me know what I missed or glossed over. And for those of you that do have it, let me know your favorite recipe in the comments.